What's up, guys? That really gross guy here. Once again, we are back heading to Iron Wake for the Haro's Chain quest, blah, 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 blah. So, yeah, we are going to be, once again, our Excalibur, uh, our Seal Meridian based Excalibur, doing the uh, little detection work that uh, we have been ta asked to do. I don't know, it's, it's kind of weird, but let's get up here. Let's talk to What's Her Face. And uh, once again, probably going to have to transference. Why? Oh, what's her face? The, the freaking Kavat doesn't like us being a Tenno. That is interesting. Okay, so. I have served Ralph my whole life, studying Ralph's teachings of the void, the dire consequence of traveling by and through it. Now I see that it is true. He alone, in his harrowing sacrifice, has guarded us. Righteous realm, outcast of sacred void, hear my voice, speak. You have been driven from the vessel by your suffering. You have swallowed the poison star so we would not. Holy realm, speak. The Tenno who rejected you have come to your aid. Oh, here we go. Uh, who? Part of me wants to say. Part, part of it's that's got to be sad. Technically, it's it. It's sad based on facial expressions. Obviously, the frown, but it works with the eyebrows and stuff too. Um, is there a reason why that one just like? lit up uh i don't think so i think they're all representing themselves slightly but it is obviously embarrassed I was wondering if this had to do anything with our light and dark meter. I don't think it's going to because this is more of just like a, uh, you know, like like he's learning. You know, maybe he's being educated because he's a young, you know, he's young. He's a kid technically. If he's on the the Zariman, which I'm assuming is what's basically happening, so he's confused. Part of me was also saying that because he was, she was talking about him being driven from his vessel, uh, I'm assuming would be Harrow, Haro, whatever, and maybe that's what uh, she was talking about when she mentioned him not being able to see, being blocked in, and his senses heightened and stuff like that. Maybe he was inside the frame, because we're still trying to figure out what exactly is inside a frame, and... Uh, technically, we see that the Tenos don't have to be inside the frame to be there, but at the same time, maybe at one point they were, blah, blah, blah. It's going to be grumpy. So all these thoughts are coming to my head as we go through, so sorry if I, you know, to kind of delay certain aspects of the, the, the gameplay, but... You know, I just want to voice my opinion and talk about some stuff. And let me know in the comments if you guys, you know. Yes, Ralph. You make me so happy. This memory, his humanity still remains. Buried in these emotions he so often failed to grasp. Could they be the key to saving him from this? Tenem, I have a theory. Return to your orbiter and I'll explain. 
Hey, look, I turned into a Haro. No, I'm stuck inside of a Haro. Um, interesting. Um, I love how Lotus is just gonna call us away. There is a possibility we could ask more questions, but Lotus, I guess, uh, she knows better. I, I don't know, but let's go see what is going on with uh, our third mission. Very interesting. All right. So do I have to go see Samaris now? Ah, uh, okay. I feel okay. Well, okay, we're doing a mission. Okay, I was gonna say if we start doing like go for missions in Warframe, I'm gonna be pissed. We already do enough that in Final Fantasy. But anyways, let's get in here. Let's uh, let's get this mission done. Ooh, we're gonna find out some more stuff. I'm excited. Oh, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. these recent quests have been fantastic. But, uh, let's go. Let's go. Holy Rel, let us bring you the peace you have earned. Guide this Tenno so you can return to the heroine vessel so that you might rest. Rel's warnings. Those dire consequences. He was talking about void exposure, wasn't he? The effect it has on human minds is well understood. But it's not. This isn't some kind of deep pressure bins as Margo has suspected. Rel saw what it was. Truly an entity. Indifferent. Old as stars. Okay. I feel like... Part of me, first of all, I feel like it's not a coincidence that she keeps using the word harrowing. Um, I don't know. That's, that's a little bit strange i get it you know tying it into the story the lore or whatever but i feel like that means she knows something i don't know i don't know we'll see what happens but uh we're in here trying to figure all that out i need to stop grabbing freaking these stupid things i don't need it i don't need it okay i'm getting a little bit trying to get a little bit faster at some of these because uh while i like the feel of this the scary you know, uh, gameplay type quest stuff. Um, kind of just moving. Kind of just wanted to, you know. First time in the mission, we are seeing full-blown uh, infested, which is to be expected at some point. But this message says, "Blinded, she cast him out." Okay, blinded, she cast him out. Did Marculus cast him out? Did um, uh, the Don 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 whatever? I, for, I I don't can't remember these names. But this new, this new female that we're, uh, we're listening to that's talking to him, did she cast him out? What exactly is going on? Haro, I don't believe, is female. Because they were talking about the vessel leaving him, casting him out or whatever. And I don't think it can be Haro. Haro. Haro! Sorry. Trap it. Trap it. Okay. Trap it. Uh, trap it. Oh, really? That was actually, that actually worked. See if you can damage it. Oh. Okay. Well, I figured, you know, scan such stuff. Okay. What if I didn't have a trap? What would have happened? 
What would have happened? Let me, uh, just real quick. Trap him again. There we go. Okay, we're going after another- oh, hello! We're going after another one. Um, I want to do my best to not, uh, mess with sound effects or do too many shots and stuff while, uh, while they're talking because, uh, in order to get, you know, you guys to hear the audio, uh, and kind of even out the sound, um, I'm going to, you know, uh, make the, the vocals a little bit louder. Excuse me. Excuse me. But, um, so if I'm going to make that louder, I don't want to make the sound effects louder because it'll obviously not be, uh, so good for you guys and your speakers and whatever. So, um, so forgive me if I'm not doing too much action while they're talking. Okay, once again, we are going to bup. Or not. Bup. Thank you. Or not. Oh, so this guy's going to come chasing us this whole time. Well, Baycor Marilac. Oh, come on. Did that really just... Okay. Alright, well, I gotta go down, I guess. Um, I didn't know he was still following me the way he was, but, uh... That happened. That happened. Let's go chase after what's-his-face. Um... Okay, hold on. Trap. Once again. Okay, can you not? Can you not? Can you just leave me be? Dude. Come back here. Oh my god, you're just wasting my time. Okay, there we go. Okay, he's down. Can you not? I can't, like, blind him or st stun him, so... It's just a matter of me staying away from him, I guess. Even though he teleports in front of me over and over and over and over and over again. Oh. Okay. Okay. No, you're fine. Alright. Um, I'm gonna obviously be fighting another one. Okay, can you not? Okay, now he turns into what's his face? What the hell? Um, so far, the one part of the mission I uh, don't care for is uh, the fact that I'm constantly being hounded. Being hounded by this red one, which is which is okay. I just feel like th I, uh, there's nothing I can really do about it. But uh, we only had to do three of them, so we seem to be in the clear at this point. Okay, so time for us to get out of here. All right, so we're gonna hop on out of here already to extraction. Interesting. So she wanted us to get out of there before Rel followed us. I wonder if he follows us to our ship or something crazy. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe he's gonna hide behind that door that we still haven't unlocked in our uh, in our orbiter. Uh, maybe. Maybe. Interesting. Uh, we didn't find out a whole lot there, but maybe we will now. Hello. Capture his manifestations? Okay, nothing? Nothing. No, no lore, no nothing? Okay, well, uh, that is mission three. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, that didn't seem very lore intensive, but I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next episode where we find out some more stuff. Blah!